So it's clear that to achieve the bad and better and even response of the strings on the whole fretboard, we have to find the correct compromise between uh, the string 8 at the saddles, which uh, then uh, applies to the fretboard uh, radius, and uh, the distance of the strings. Uh, uh, from the strings to the pickup poles here. So uh, I have set up this base to have um, the, the most even response possible on all the fretboards. So these are the, you know, uh, strings. The, the strings are sounding exactly the same way on, on you know on all the frets, uh, starting from the G to the B. I will now show you with the digital caliber all the settings that I made, all the, the last fret of the fretboard and over the, the, the pickups. So you can use this setting as a starting point to achieve the best tone uh, from your bass and make your B string finally uh, sound as you've seen that this one sounds. Let me do that now. So consider I'm using 045, 06, 65, 080, 100 and 130 strings gauge so i am i'm giving you the measurement uh, from the top of the last fret to the top the upper part of the string so the first one the the, the g string is actually 3.2 3.23 the the D string is actually 389. The A string is 427. The E string is 484. And the uh, uh, B string is uh, four is 546. I'm going now to the neck pickup. Okay, let's go now to the the neck pickup. I'm giving you the distance from the top of the of the string to the uh, the magnet. Keep in mind that uh, there is there is a trick that I can tell you here. If you ever hear your bass sounding, you know, just like mud or you know some something that you 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 don't like about your bass, try lowering the neck pickup, and you will you will you can be surprised about how the tone is improving. And now we're going to send you to give you the measurement. So the first string is 517. The second one is 597. The, the A one is 676. The G is 772. And the low B is at 834 from the magnet. Now to the bridge pickup, the, the Jeff J bass, the Frudo Jeff J bass has a couple of JJ pickup to the in the bridge position. So this one is in the exact point of the scale where the Jeff original Fender Jeff bass is. So I will give you that one. Uh, so the first string is uh, uh, 469 from the up of the string part of the string and to the pole the second one the D one is 499 is 536 uh, uh, 537 the the A one 630 the E and the Low B is about 653. Very well, we are at the end of this new video for the bass player, our friends bass players, uh, about how to achieve the best sounding low B string possible from our bass. As you have seen, it's something, you know, maybe it's not that easy, 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 but it's not that difficult anyway. Uh, please watch video carefully, follow each step carefully, you will absolutely be able to do exactly what I did in the video on your side. So we did that at home, so it's, it's you know, with no tools, so it's very, very, very easy. 
and uh, I plan to make some other video for bass players, especially I was thinking about one about removing the, the low, uh, the, the dead note uh, from the bass, which is something which happens very often on bolt on basses. Anyway, we'll see you later. Uh, hope you like the video. If you like it, diffuse it as uh, the most possible. And thanks a lot for your time with me. Thanks a lot. Ciao, bye.